Hey, what's up, fellas? How you doing, man? It's Anelli here. Hey, what's going on, guys? How we doing, man? It's Anelli here. Today we're looking at a one-two-three double play. We're gonna focus in here on the catcher and their footwork to make sure that one, they're clearing a lane to throw, and two, they're getting away from the play so they don't get taken out. This has been a uh, pretty big discussion over the last week or so um, because the catcher got taken out during a big league game and everyone's saying, you know, they're asking, was it a cheap play by the runner to take the to take the catcher out? Um, and so to ensure that we don't get taken out and that we don't get injured, got to make sure that we use the right footwork. So what you'll see LaCroix do here, here's the comebacker. LaCroix is going to set up. He's got his right foot on the plate right there. He's got his left foot. He's not already into a stretch position. He's pretty square. You know, probably right there would be perfectly square, so maybe be a little bit in front of square. But he's given the pitcher a target, and he's not stretching out too early. Now, he catches the ball, and now he's going to take his left foot out. Now, what I've seen catchers do this. I've seen some do it this way. I've seen other catchers, as the ball's coming, they'll start to stretch out with their left foot. Once they see the ball and see where the ball's coming, they'll step towards the ball with their left foot. All right. Once they do that, now you're going to see he's going to start to work his right foot this way. So now he's getting himself away. So two things, getting himself away from the plate, but then also working himself here to have a lane to throw. So... You want to make sure, one, for your safety, that you don't just catch, put your left foot down and throw from right here because you're going to get kicked in the back of the leg, all right? So that's the first thing. You've got to step with your left foot and then shuffle. Take your right towards your left, left towards your target. That'll get you away from the plate. But when you're doing it, you also want to make sure that you're getting this way. You do not want to be right on the line because then you have to throw over the runner's head. So I want to be able to get inside, create a lane, so I'm throwing from in here. Now the first baseman needs to read, you know, on a comebacker, he's going to be to the inside because you're obviously going to be to the inside. If you block a ball and the ball goes over this way, well, then the first baseman should get to the outside, all right? So first baseman is just reading wherever you're going, the catcher's going, and then should get inside like you see right there. Left foot on the bag, square to the target, and now I've given the catcher a lane to throw to all right so again really important play one that should be practiced although it doesn't happen all the time like i said it can be a big play in the game you're probably going to have you know well you're obviously going to have bases loaded um when you're doing a force play here so it's a big part of the game but then also for injury prevention, like we talked about, it can be a dangerous play with base runners coming in hard if the catcher doesn't know exactly how to get away and how to put himself um, out of harm's way. So hopefully this helps you guys out. Let me know if you have any questions in the comment section below. Subscribe to the channel. Share the video with all your friends. Give it a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate that. Uh, check out the description box below. I've got a bunch of stuff down there as well for you guys to check out. we got a deal going on with Plate Crate. You guys get 50% off your first plate crate. Uh, if you put in Antonelli, click on the link, type in Antonelli. We also have our Patreon page linked down there where you guys can support the channel. we got a bunch of other stuff, so definitely check that out. And that's all I got. Thanks so much again for watching. I appreciate it, guys, and we will talk to you later.